Hey everybody, what's going on? Shabby Do here, and today I thought we'd get back into Builder Simulator after we did the tutorial. People did talk about this game a little bit and wanted to see a little bit more, so let's start a new game here and see what we can do once we've uh, done this. So let's get the play test going. So, like I said, this is the play test version of the game, so it's a, not even an early access version at the time. They're obviously just testing a few things, so we're probably just going to be going through the same motions like we did before. So, but now we're going to do them all at once. That's my guess here. So we've got our diggy diggy diggies here. Yep, we're digging. 99 out of 100. Is that my level? Okay, I'm, I'm happy with that. I don't know why I'm already level 100, but probably just to speed speed things up here while we're uh you know in the play test because i remember in the tutorial when we were laying the bricks down it says you know there were levels so you could do things faster all right let's go into the build mode let's grab a hundred of each of these okay and we'll place god that this is just so satisfying right here like this ah right there that's the stuff Oh, we need more. Give me another hundred. I don't care about the cash. Oh, not those. These. Bam. God, it just... It, it sounds nice. It looks good. Throw down our rebars here. Oh, man. It, it just feels right like this is how i expect a builder simulator to kind of go like it's in-depth enough but at least from playing the tutorial it doesn't seem to be like crazy in depth you know what i mean to like where you don't want to play it anymore because it's not fun all right so now we need concrete i was really confused one time when I did this, so let's uh okay get get my hands out here. Let's turn this on. Let's do concrete. And let's do auto. And then we'll put our wheelbarrow underneath it. Alright. And then tilty tilt. Okay. Leave. I'm curious. Trowel. Doesn't say anything. Okay. So grab this. There we go. So now we can just go along and take care of all this. And it looks like we're running a lot out a lot quicker than we did in the tutorial, which makes sense, honestly. But it is using it even when you're not pouring it. So definitely be careful about that. All right, that's empty. Let's uh, speed this up. All right, that's complete. So now we got to dig up the floor here. So we just kind of go across. And yeah, I remember this. We could just, we could really get into this too. So I want to make sure, I want to get a good angle. So like this here. So let's dig right across like that. Then we'll dig this little section out. We'll kind of switch off. So I was off a little bit there. So like right here-ish. Yeah, that's the good stuff. Try and do this with that as little clicks as possible, right? Not too shabby. Oopsies. Just kind of, I'm just going to get all haphazard with this now. My clicker fingers are getting tired. 
All right, we're almost done digging out the floor now. So now we need to spread sand, sand. So let's bring the wheelbarrow over here. Wait, can I just empty this? Yes, I can. Okay, cool. Oopsies. That's handy. So I can just tip it out until this is empty. And it was a lot faster when we did it with sand or when we did it but with the wheelbarrow because look, if I put like one down, right? Like just that square. That's the whole thing. Even that little thing right there's the whole thing. <clears throat> but a scoop is 25%. So if I do four scoops, that'll fill up our wheelbarrow. And then if I grab this, come out here and just kind of look, look, look how much more we're getting out of this and faster too. So, you know, use your wheelbarrow. Unless you have a guy that's working on the job with you and you really don't like him. Like maybe if, uh, you know, this becomes multiplayer or something and we get Mr. Twigs with us, maybe we'll put him on like shovel duty and I'll be like, hey, you know, don't just grab the shovel and go and get sand and just fill this in and just see how long it, he goes back and forth for. You know, that, <laughs> that could be entertaining to watch. <laughs> Let me know what you think about that down in the comments below. We all know he doesn't watch these videos. He he won't know what we're talking about. <laughs> Make it a live stream. Just watch him build a house by hand. No wheelbarrow. I don't think he can pour the foundations though without a wheelbarrow. But you know we can we could all we can dream. Okay, and did I miss a spot? I think there's a spot like over here. Yeah, there it is. All right, dump this down. So we need to get um uh do, do, do lay the reinforcing mesh. So I'm gonna need um this stuff. Let's buy a hundred of that for now, and let's see how this goes. And this, oopsies, this was another one that I just have to like kind of repeatedly press. So we'll speed through this. All right, that should be good with that. So we we laid that and now we got to prepare concrete and pour it in. So, whoops, wrong button. Let's bring that over here. Let's, I've got concrete selected. Let's hit that auto. Let's hit that, oops, oops. Hit that spin button. Oh, it's complete? Okay. All right, that's good to go. Let's. Turn this off so we don't waste money. Remember, fuck a second every time you have this thing running. Gotta pay that electric bill. All right, so we're gonna come over here. So same thing, we're just kind of, yep, so it was done. So we're just pouring our concrete in. How satisfying, huh? Gotta make sure it's like fully poured though. It is going to take a little bit of concrete again. So as usual, you know, we'll, uh, we'll speed this up a little bit. Beautiful. So that's been done now. So we need to spread sand bedding, lay the that. And so we need to lay floor insulation now and then pour concrete over it again. So let's go down here. Let's buy, um, I'll get, I'll get a hundred pieces for now. I don't think I'm going to need it that, but, and then, yep. Same kind of thing. I need to just repeatedly press. So we'll just go across this real quick. Like, And the last pieces look fantastic. Make sure that is all of them looks to be that way. So that's done now. So now we just need to pour concrete over it again. So let's grab our shovel. I've got a little bit left in here. Might as well just use that down real quick. The so same process as we did before. We just need to go through and add another layer of concrete. We'll see you in another montage later.
All right, beautiful. So that step is now complete. It's looking, starting to look really good here. Everything's just so smooth. It's a very relaxing type of gameplay. Maybe if you guys would like to just see a stream of this and we just kind of do like a let's chat kind of thing too as we go. Let me know down in the comments if we can work something out. Maybe over the weekend or something. Who knows? All right, so let's create some mortar and apply it to the trowel. Apply mortar, insert it to the block. So we'll switch it to mortar, hit auto. We'll reset our barrow. Uh, this, let's dump this out so we have it with filled with mortar instead. Okay. Okay, perfect. Mortar. And what's great about this is we can just load up our trowel once and then it'll always be full. What's this mini game? Oh. Gets the whole line of them done. What happens if I miss? There's a couple of them. Okay. That's nice. Okay. Oh, that's actually really nice. So nice little successful skill gap here. You can just get a whole row of this done at a time. That's actually pretty good. That's honestly pretty good. I mean, we don't even need to speed this one up. This is just nice, simple, easy game kind of stuff here. That's not... That we need a little bit more mortar though. Let's hit that button. Let's tilt this back down here. Excuse you. Can you fill that up, please? Thank you. Appreciate you. Get my trowel with some more more mortar on it. More mortar. But obviously there's only two there, so that was fast enough to just do like that. Like even some of these, like honestly, like, is it faster to do the thing? I don't know. Like you know, I just kind of cruised through all this. So, I, you know, I missed a couple spots here and there. But, all right, let's see about these block structures now. So, we'll need a couple hundred of those probably. So, we need um, uh, hollow blocks. So, I'm going to grab... I'll just grab 200 because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need more. Or at least this. All right, there's no mini game, But it's, it's another one of those to where I can just kind of go all the way across like this now the question is how do I add a door in here like is it gonna automatically put doors in for me or or um am I oh yeah it looks like that's gonna be a door right there okay it's doing it automatically for us. so let's speed this up and let's get all of our hollowed stones down
All right, so it looks like we got the kind of the base going. So we need to get those, uh, I forgot what they're called, the, uh, the, the lintel. So I need one, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14 of them. So let's grab 14 lintels. 10 and then 14. Okay. So we'll put these down. And then obviously we'll need to get another batch of mortar still. So this part has taken a little bit of time. I feel like I've been going at it for maybe 15 minutes or so right now. So yeah, that's how long it took in that little speed up you saw. A lot quicker for you, I'm sure. Now with the walls complete, all we have left to do is the ceiling here, which doesn't look like it's going to be too hard. So let's get into the store. We buy our stuff here. Um, I'm thinking, I don't, I don't even know. Let's just grab a, I don't know, 20 of these, 30 of these. I think, I don't know. Let's go 40. I think 40 will be good. So we'll just put these up. But guys, if you're loving this so far and you do want to see more Builder Simulator in the future, make sure you do hit that like button down below. Leave me a comment letting me know what you think so far. But with this, we'll have pretty much the exterior done and we'll be working on the interior after. So I think this will be a good place to stop. So make sure you hit that subscribe button down below if you want to see what the rest of this house is going to look like. And while you're down there, like I said, leave me a comment letting me know what you think of this so far. OK, so but as usual, like I said, yeah. Oh, one more piece. Shoot. And oop, two. And now we're done. But all right, guys, as usual, this has been Shabby Do. And hope the rest of your day is not too shabby. <laughs>